On this week's Arts Break, Chief Curator Mark Scala talks about two of the masterpieces included in the Frist Center's exhibition on the birth of Impressionism. Visitors to the exhibition will notice immediately that even though the title of the exhibition is The Birth of Impressionism, there are a lot of paintings in the exhibition that are not Impressionist at all. And really the idea of this show is to explore what was going on in Paris in 1874 around the time that Impressionism really burst fully onto the scene. When you come into a room like this, you see a very different take on the Impressionist project. For both Degas and Kayabot, the painter of the floor scrapers, the whole approach was much more systematic and much more thoughtful and classical in their procedure. So somebody like Kayabot would actually make study after study after study. They worked from photographs, from drawings, carefully composing it. So it looks like it's just an immediate snapshot. It looks like it was taken just as the action of the floor scrapers was poised in mid-reach or mid-scrape. But really, it's a matter of very, very careful planning and composition on the part of the artist. We were so excited when the Musée d'Orsay offered to send us this painting that is commonly known as Whistler's Mother, although the actual title is Arrangement in Gray and Black Number no. 1, A Portrait of the Painter's Mother. Now the question that always arises, why is that painting of the artist's mother something that has seemed to capture people's imagination so much? And my suspicion is that people have thought of Americans as being no nonsense, you know, nothing extraneous. And if you look at the character of his mother as shown in her face, she's a very flinty character. She's dressed like a Puritan, and she has a very puritanical expression on her face. She looks very severe. And so I think that between the two of those aspects, that this seems to embody something of the American character, and also its importance as and essentially abstract work of art, long before abstraction was invented, really accounts for the importance and in some ways the popularity of the painting. The Birth of Impressionism is on display at the Frist Center for the Visual Arts through January 23rd. For more information, visit us online at wnpt.net slash arts. This NPT Arts Break is made possible by the generous support of the Ingram Charitable Fund and the Metropolitan Nashville Arts Commission.